Hello and welcome back to our channel. I am Farwa and you're watching Ninja Iraqi Dinar News YouTube channel. Hopefully you all will be fine. Let's start today. Guru Frank 26. Question. Do you think the rate might come out more than 1 to 1 or higher? It is possible they might be looking at $1.18, 1 to 1. Is a good start, no doubt, but it's been 20 years. And I think 1.18 is fair enough to start the float at against the dollar. The goal is to go past the dollar. Guru Bruce Iraq is looking to put their HCL law in the Gazette, along with their new international rates. And since Friday is a high holy day. I don't know this, but I think they would probably put it in the virtual online version, if you will, the Digital Gazette on Friday, and put it in the printed version of the Gazette on Saturday. Militiaman, do your own research. Get professional advice. I don't care if it's legal, tax, anything. Everybody should get their own professionals. I'm not one, nor is my crew. We just help read the news. Guru, Claire article. Strengthening the balance of Iraqi banks in foreign currency supports the private sector and the local market. The increase in the currency exchange rate by accredited banks provides another safe path to meet the local market's needs for foreign currency. Guru Bruce, we were supposed to, according to, pretty high up sources to be exchanging Wednesday or Thursday, and I had clarifications that we would be exchanging. Well, guess what? We are not yet exchanging. I think there's a number of factors and one in particular that's delayed us slightly. Everything really is ready to go. I really do believe that we are ready. Why are all these countries, why are all these companies saying such great and wonderful things about Iraq and Sudani when they never did before? Why is it that Parliament is saying beautiful things about reforms and the success of it that Sudani has had? There is a change in your Iraqi citizens' monetary policy. Your monetary sovereignty is coming to you before 24, Guru Breitling. In the article, they want to go and do this monetary sovereignty. What do they have to do? They have to eliminate the U.S. dollar out of the public. But the dollars they eliminate, they want to put into their reserve. So they're not de-dollarizing. They're trying to build up their reserve and at the same time expand the supply time's velocity of their currency. Guru marks yes, it's deck first. And yes, we were hoping we would have gone by now, but the Redemption Center folks will be on call this weekend. They are very hopeful for the next few days. We can feel this is so close, which makes it much tougher to wait. Guru MNT Goat Advisor to the Prime Minister Economic policy in Iraq is moving towards implementing the principle of monetary sovereignty. Wow, it tells us flat right out in the open that Iraq is about to take complete control over their currency again. Wow! This has reinstatement and RV written all over this statement. Guru Bruce, we really do have good contact in Iraq, and we're getting word that the ATM machines are filled with the lower denomination bills, like ours, 10, 20, 50, and 100 dinar notes. I think those are all available in the actual ATM machines. Now they have been working, since Thanksgiving maybe a little bit before that, in the airport locations in Baghdad and at the border location wherever the ATMs are at the border. They are working now, and they are in use. I do not believe they're all in use all over the country yet. But I think that is about to change. They are minting new coins for people to use. Iraqis are going to feel a little jingle in their pockets soon. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe for more new videos.